Hey guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Kara Michelle and I am here to help you live your truth. And on today's video, I really wanna talk about a major mindset shift that changed everything for me. And I think it's gonna help you so much, whether you are navigating really heavy things and heavy struggles, or whether it's just everyday stress, doubt, anxiety, all of those things, this shift can change everything for you. Okay, so here I am in Bali and I have had some things going on <laughs> in my life and I feel like I need to share because this perspective shift is something that used to really affect me and hold me back. So years ago when I did one of my first solo trips, um, there were definitely a lot of highs and a lot of good things on my trip but there were also some times where things didn't go as planned and it caused a lot of stress and anxiety for me and one perfect example was when i was in the philippines um, there are <laughs> millions of islands there there's a lot of planning that needs to go into your trip there and the weather is a big factor and time is a big factor in getting to all these places so um, I was kind of underprepared, we could say, and I ended up on this island, which ended up getting hit by a storm for like multiple, multiple days, and none of the boats were leaving. And I remember I had this really big pity party <laughs> by myself one moment because I was like stuck there. It had been raining for days. I couldn't get off the island. And, um, like I just really wanted to keep seeing places because it's like you know I only have 30 days in the Philippines I want to do all these things I had all these plans and now I'm stuck and what I realized at that time was how consumed I was getting in my current reality and how small that detail really was like it really wasn't a big deal I should just be happy that I'm safe, that I'm alive, and I realized that I should be very, very happy that I was in the Philippines in January when it was like minus 50 back home in Canada where I'm from. So being stranded, even if it's raining, is still better than being in the frigid cold bundled up with like 18 jackets on. <laughs> so what i realized was how much my mindset affected me and my mood and what kind of outcome i had there because if i continued to focus on the negative the rest of that trip probably could have been ruined because i was constantly looking for more things that were going wrong more things that were making me upset right but by switching this by realizing the positive finding that silver lining you know finding the gratitude it changed everything for me and so often when we're in hardships or I wouldn't call that a hardship but you know what I mean like when something isn't going the way that we want it to so often we end up focusing on that more and more and more and giving all our attention and energy to it and then amplifying it and really getting pulled in further into that hole so if you want more help with this and more kind of like awareness on your mindset and breaking down why it's so important, how to shift out of it, uh, head to the link down below because I've got a free mindset training that will help you so much with this. But what I've noticed today, because now I'm in Bali and I was planning originally to be here for another two weeks, but a series of events happened. Uh, there were multiple things that kind of all added up together. Some birds going crazy up there. <laughs> um, there were multiple events that happened, but um, it just felt like, you know what? I think I'm ready to go home. And I also was mildly forced because I lost my credit card. <laughs> it got eaten by the ATM machine and all of my other cards are not working for some reason. So anyway, long story short, but um, I realized that this situation this time was like a thousand times better than the situation in the Philippines because this time I've just been smiling and happy the whole time and I've honestly been like eh cool I get to go home that's fun like I'm excited to see my dog I'm excited to see my parents and um instead of finding the negative and being upset that like things didn't go to plan and 
my trip ended early and blah 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 like there could be a bunch of things that I could find wrong to focus on but it hasn't even crossed my mind like not even once and I'm not making that up it's just been mind-blowing I've been like so grateful I'm like yeah you know what it's been a great two weeks so I'm so glad I was here and like oh you know what I'm excited to go back home and hey you know what there's actually a lot of things that I can finish up and loose ends I can tie up there that are going to be positive so I'm looking forward to it and not once has that mentality of why me or oh you know like this is ruining everything not once has that crossed my mind but that's because I've put in years and years and years of practice. It's because I study mindfulness training. It's why, uh, because I meditate a lot. There's a lot of factors around why my mindset was so peaceful or like agreeable. And um, the last part that I wanted to add to this as well is just the understanding that like I personally believe everything works out the way it's supposed to everything happens for a reason and by having that belief and that kind of you're letting go you're letting go of that need to control that need to be stressed about all the things that you don't think are working out but that's you as in your ego whereas when you trust that everything's happening for a reason you're letting go and you're trusting in a higher power a bigger thing the thing that's way bigger than you, right? So it takes you out of that ego mind and the victim mindset, the poor me, the stress, the overwhelm, the let me keep thinking about this for days and days and looking at all the ways it's gone wrong. It takes you out of that and brings you back into who we truly are as spiritual beings, into that connectedness of knowing that it's not actually bad. Like there is no good or bad. Everything just is. And the more I can accept it, the more at peace I'm going to be with the reality. And the more likely I'm going to enjoy the moment, the more likely I'm going to attract something good to come right after, right? So when you can believe that everything works out for you and everything's happening for a reason, your whole mentality changes. So I would highly recommend you practice this if you aren't already. And just remember that everything can look like a really big problem when you're very close up. But when you step back, you take a look, you take a deep breath and um, just kind of reconnect to the bigger picture, everything will change for you. So this will be not my last video from Bali, but one of the last videos from Bali since I have to leave in a few days. But I'm just grateful for it. and. All the birds have gone quiet now, but see the sun sunset a little bit. You can't really see it, but <laughs> I tried. Uh, it's a beautiful night. It's warm. There's lizards. Look at. Isn't he so cute? <laughs> There's so much gratitude. There's so many things to be thankful for. It's a beautiful, beautiful world. And if you focus on that, you'll notice it more. You'll feel better and um, you'll be able to find the silver lining a lot quicker. So just remember that you get to decide every day what attitude you take on and you determine the trajectory of your day. It's not about the events that happen. It's not about what takes place around you. It's about what takes place within you and that's what you get to control. So do the mindset work master your response to life you know really tune into how you react to things and work on it (laughs) because that is the journey and that's what's going to get you to a much more stress-free life because you cannot control and you cannot ever eliminate the stress from outside but if you can eliminate it inside then you're not really ever going to have a bad day because you're always going to be able to find your way through so I think that about sums it up. (laughs) I will see you guys on the next video and let me know in the comments down below actually before I go, let me know if this resonates. Let me know if you have, um, if you've been working on this mindset in your own life and if you've noticed the benefit of kind of leaning back, trusting, believing in a higher power, like believing that everything's working out the way it's meant to. Oh my god. (laughs)
Did you see that? I hope that's on video. It was a bat and he just flew like literally almost flew and hit me in the head with my mouth open. <laughs> of course. Um, let me know. I've lost my train of thought. Let me know in the comments your thoughts about this. Let me know your own experience and how finding the silver lining, focusing on the gratitude um, instead of focusing on the negative has helped you. And with that, I will officially end this video. See you guys later.